Saturday evening. We're not going to do a serious devotional tonight. Uh, today was a weigh-in day for my gut loss program. Uh, we've finished the uh, cursory overview of the book of Joshua. We'll just do a little highlighting of that. And uh, yeah, tomorrow I'm going to take a day off. And uh, just do a little relaxing. And we'll get back at our uh, devotionals on Monday. So, like I said, today was a weigh-in day. And... Now at the beginning of week 25, I am 202 pounds. The day is coming real quick when I'll be able to write a one in front. I'm really looking forward to that. I'm, uh, I'm going to try real hard not to ever let that two show up first again in my weight. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so that's done. Let's see. A little review of Joshua. Uh, what did we learn in Joshua? When the Israelites, well, the Israelites got into their promised land in the book of Joshua, and when they followed the, the Lord's rules and regulations, things went well for them. When they decided to do things on their own, not so good. And... That should, like the key point to take out of that is when you're following God, you got to do something. You have to take some action. The Israelites didn't just grab the U-Haul and move in. They still had to fight some battles. And then, uh, yeah, the biggest takeaway I'll, I'll I have is uh, you really need to fear God and that's a healthy thing mm. we are heading toward the end times at a, a pace that I've never seen before and uh your faith has to be strong. You have to have courage. And if you're fearing God, it's a little tougher to fear man. Because man can only take your body, kill your body. God can take your soul and body. So don't worry about the persecution that Christians are going to suffer as we get into these hazardous times. Be of good faith, be of good cheer if you are following God. That's the bottom line. And it's not a real, it's not a picture of an eagle, but that's the closest I got. All those who wait upon the Lord will renew their strength. They will rise up with wings like eagles. They will run and not be weary. They will walk and not faint. Amen. Amen.
So next week we'll get started in the book of Judges. And uh, I'm going to leave you with this I haven't left you with for a while. This is a benediction. Heavenly Father, bless my viewers and protect them. Lord, smile on them and be gracious to them. Lord, show them your favor and give them your peace. There is peace when you're resting in God. Uh, keep your faith strong. Stay in, the, stay in God's word. That's one of the reasons why I do this daily devotional. To help, help you just to stay in the word. So, we all have a good night. God willing, we'll see you on Monday. And let's see, uh, the new word for this week. I have it here, innocuous. <laughs> Y'all take care. See you on Monday. Dance the dance, 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 dance the